Jim Alexander here with Real Talker at the premiere of Creatress. We are talking to Fran Drescher, the director. Everyone's here on set. Well, not on set, actually, on the red carpet. So we're talking about what happened on set. Stay tuned for my interviews coming up next. About two years ago, through Amy Chokin. Where we're at? We had a phone interview. Oh, that day, we're, you were okay, living cool. in New York, I think, at the time, in the East Coast. Is that, is okay, that right? You that were commuting could be, back okay, and forth? Right, yeah, bouncing around, living yes. out of a suitcase. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't I'm know if you said that exactly. I'm just actually off a plane, like, literally, like, six hours ago, too, so, from New York. So, uh, it's been exciting since, I guess. I remember you are working on the, uh, the fitness stuff, too, yep, right? Yeah, yeah. And so, I'm um, Jim Alexander, by the way. Awesome. Cool, cool, yeah, good sign. Um, so how's life since? I mean, you're out here now, so it's a, it looks good. Yeah, life has been exciting. Um, blessed to be involved with such cool, creative people. Um, uh, actually, doing the fitness stuff, um, the uh, producer, Liliana, we are probably going to Columbia to do work on some a couple of fitness projects for a non-scripted series. So that's going to be at the end of the month that I'm excited about. Um, have a couple of films coming out, just uh, still involved with The Good Place, and they got an Emmy nomination. Um, Ted Danson got um, one for Best Actor, Deserved as well. Love Ted. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Just on the grind, moving, um, living life. So you're still uh, based in New York and, and commuting kind of here? So since we talked okay, so last, I've kind of been transitioning more to have um, L.A. as my primary base, but I'm still pumping back to New York, and I still love New York City. Too. There you go. Tell me about this film. Tell me about your role in it. What can we expect from you? So I just think it's um, pretty much the whole story is kind of uh, revolving around the lead, um, the lead character played by Lindy Booth, and basically she's kind of... There's some based in reality, and then there's some based in kind of her imaginings as far as um, what she's authoring, if you will, and writing as it goes. So some of the characters you don't know yet if she's writing them and it's the actual reality, or if it's the um, kind of her storyline. So my character, for the most part, we'll see how it, uh, I haven't seen it yet, is edited, is basically just um, a fictional character. And I didn't find that out till later. <laughs> so you're <laughs> not kind of really real, but you're yeah, real. I'm kind of real, but not. Um, we'll see. Yeah, so. That's awesome. Um, tell me, I mean, this is a great cast. Oh, yeah. Fran Drescher, Peter Bogdanovich, anything that you took away being around such people who've been around this industry for so long? Most of my stuff was with Lindy, and um, uh, she's just very professional. And then working with Jason, too, having a lot of um, time in front of the camera as an actor. Um, I was just mentioning that he's an actor's director, so kind of uh, keeping it to the script and also being okay with letting you have some creative liberty. So it was just kind of a fun collaborative creative experience. There you go. Have you done any writing yourself? I know you're doing a bunch of stuff. You have been doing a bunch of stuff. Have you done any writing yourself? Yeah, I tried to do. Um, a, a friend of mine which has been telling me for years that if you do some writing, it's also very um, influential into your acting. So I've kind of been doing that and I'll write just little notes of like script ideas. So I have a ton of treatments, none yet fully completed, but um, the unscripted one that I was telling you about that I'm working on with um, uh, Liliana is a lot of structure, so even though it's unscripted, it was quite a bit of writing, actually, ironically, so um, yes, I'm going further that way, and uh, hopefully I'll get some inspiration from the movie, too. So you might be going to Columbia, you're doing a lot of coast-to-coast -coast travels, any plans for a summer, anything cool you got going on? Oh, man, uh, you know, I want to get up to do a little more traveling on the West Coast. Since I've been here the last two years, I want to go up to um, Big Sur. That's kind of... Heard good things about Yeah, and so that's on the bucket list. I want to hit up Big Sur. Check that out. It's beautiful up there. Perfect. And I'm glad we got to connect yeah, finally in person a couple years in. Sweet.